Excuse me. Oh, he's chasing me. He's chasing me. He's chasing me. I feel like I'm getting turned around already. <laughs> I know what I need to do. <laughs> I need to beat the shit out of some puppets. <laughs> I'm sorry. more real than reality felt like I was lost walking through this dark tunnel and the ground beneath me stretched on for an eternity felt like I was dying he swerved out of his lane striking a passenger van that started a pile up Killing seven. Jesus. In weather, we'll all be sad to see another band of thunderstorms heading toward the city tomorrow night. I just had this insane sense of of um, emptiness and terror, and I just, I just. I don't care who she sees. We're not even married anymore. She can see whoever she wants. Reality TV shows be like. So, Ashley, what did you do to end up solving your problem? Nothing. I ignored it. Tried to forget. I watched television. And that helped? It dulls the pain. You've been escaped around. Yeah! We're just starting the game off like this. This is how the game started. I didn't even get the chance to do my intro. Oh shit, there's difficulty selections? All right, hold on, hold on. This is my chance to do the, the intro. Hey, yo, what's poppin'? Party people. I'm that one dude, Chris, from YouTube, and welcome to my friendly neighborhood or i guess welcome back um if any of you remember a year ago on in march i believe march 22nd to be exact um i played the demo for this game and i i really enjoyed it this was actually the first game that i played with the camera that i'm using right now the very high quality camera <laughs> so this game has a very special place in my heart because it was when a lot of things were picking up on the channel i had this game on my steam wish list from the moment i played the demo and it released i think earlier this week on the 18th so i'm very excited to play it i'm very excited to get into it see what the full game is all about because i had some questions by the end of the demo i'm gonna a difficulty for those experienced with survival horror uh um we're gonna play normal, at least for the first run. If I ever do decide to play this again, um, maybe I'll try survival, but normal for, for the start, because. Okay, last job of the day. What's this one about? Sprocket Palm Property Management, work order request. Client City New Network Broadcasting Group, Property 123 Sunrise Street, date July 8th, 1993. Crewman assigned Gordon J. O'Brien. Description of problem. Vacant. Oops. No, I didn't. Shit. Um. Oh. Antenna. Uh, uh. The day is always the worst. I'm not leaving yet. I just got here. You right. You right. I just wanted to check. Hey, candy bar. Oh, I'm not eating that. That's been there for days. Why is it still here then? That's disgusting. Clean up your mess. Don't be a man baby. All right. So I'm very excited for this game. It, it caught my eye. It caught my attention when we first played it. And I just, I'm, I'm hyped. I'm, I'm ready to go. <laughs> 
locked is a key card reader. Okay, I'm just uh, I'm just checking my surroundings, making sure that I uh, have everything I need. There's an elevator. Maybe it still works. Ugh, this game looks so nice. Very shiny. Concessions. Um, okay. Can't do anything with that just yet. This area is off limits. Watch me. Watch me. Uh, watch me break those limits. Yeah. George. Looks like something could be placed here. Uh, they're setting me up for puzzles. Liliana or Lilana? Lil oh no 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 that's an I. So it's Liliana. Okay. Leonard. Junebug. And Norman. We saw these. I think we saw these three in the demo. What on earth? Ew. Is this glue? Ew. Okay. Ring me. Ring, ring, ring! Okay. Raise the curtain. Bring up the lights. The neighborhood is coming <coughs> to town. Uh, hello. I'm here to disconnect the antenna. Television's heartbeat has returned. A spirit of cheer brightens every child's eye. The cry goes round the kindergarten class. The neighborhood. The neighborhood. Okay. I I'm here to disconnect the antenna. I am Ricky the Sock. That's good, Ricky. Television will never be the same. We hold on. Did you say disconnect the antenna? That's what I said. Oh my, no, 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 no. You mustn't do that. That would be a catastrophe. It's broadcasting over the news. The news? No, no, trust me. The antenna is just fine as it is. Doesn't need any disconnecting. Tell you what, you wait here and I'll... And I'll, uh... I'll get, I'll get you some... Bro, are you good? <laughs> Where did that come from? Take a sec. Um, okay then. Where did that come from? Your sock. Stage four. Okay. That was special. I believe special is an understatement, my friend. There's a bunch of keys back there that I cannot get to. I would like to uh, be able to access all doors in this building. Thank you very much. Okay, so from what I'm getting so far is that... Oh, Bitcoin? Whoa! Why could I just pick that up? As I was saying, from what I'm getting based on this so far, we don't know... Can I check my inventory? Is there a button for that? Oh, wait, 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 wait. I know where I'm supposed to take this. Hang on. We don't know anything about this place off rip. Um, Cause in the demo, we came down a slide and then we knew who Ricky was when he popped out of the pipe. So that must be like far later in the game. Cause we seem extremely acquainted with this place at that point in the demo. The meal, the meal hey. Who's that? Norman? Norman? Norman! Norman, my guy! How were you able to get through the door without a key card, but I needed a key card to get through the door? Do the puppets have key cards on them? <clears throat> Are the puppets the key cards? Oh. Oh, hold on. Oh, I got Bitcoin. <laughs> I got some Bitcoin. The City Tribune, Saturday, November 9th, 1968. Television's friendly 
Television's Friendly New Neighborhood, review of My Friendly Neighborhood by Richard Lightsburg. Lightsbury. This week saw the premiere of a new series on the City Network aimed at a preschool age children at preschool age children. My Friendly Neighborhood. The show centers on the titular Friendly Neighborhood and its resident puppets, who, with the help of adults like Stevie, Richie Bromine, teach viewers about a variety of subjects including numbers, letters, and how to be a friendly neighbor. The show's catch-all term for age-old lessons about caring and sharing. While adult viewers may find their message free, trite, children's hearts are captured by the neighbors. Each felt furball uh, becomes a beloved friend whose words are hung onto a trust and devotion rarely seen in older audiences. Previously aired as Ricky and Friends, an independent public access television, the series, and creator Al Gerswald. I remember I made a joke about this guy's last name. Uh, were recently signed by the City Network Broadcasting Group, and production moved to the historic City Network Hotel Studio on the west side. Their move into the big leagues of broadcasting is accompanied, is accompanied by the Texas ineligible. Okay. All right. So I know enough about these kids' TV show horror games to gather that. Richie or Richard or whoever it was, somebody with the name Richie or Richard, anything associated with possibly being Ricky, these puppets are all possessed or, you know, humans turned into puppets for the sake of this show. I'm calling it right now. There's the plot twist. I've seen, I've played Amanda the Adventurer. I know the deal. Oh, wait, what did I just press? I just pressed something. Okay, that was F. Okay. So this is where I see all my documents. Got it. Extraordinary. Norman! It's locked from the other side. Good, good. Everybody say it with me. Locked doors mean safety. Got it. You guys are so smart. You're awesome. I'm gonna open this door one time. Oh, okay. They they allow you to go in so many different directions. I no, can't get through there. Maybe I can find a key. Uh, excuse me, sir. Excuse me. Oh, he's chasing me. He's chasing me. He's chasing me. I should have known better than that. Oh. Okay. Bitcoin. What are you talking about? Huh. Puppets are weird. Locked. Oh. Magazine. Health. You can use health o lax to restore health. Press tab to open your inventory. E to continue. Oh. Oh. Does this also restore health? Shit. I wasted that. I unfortunately wasted a candy bar, which probably could have done me some good later in the game. But we'll see. Exterior Main Street. The neighborhood is having an outdoor bazaar. Everyone is lining up at Leonard's Antique Display to try on a beautiful pair of earrings. Pearl enters seeing the earrings and cuts into the line pushing Liliana out of the way and causing a commotion. Stevie, standing up from a bench, Pearl, that wasn't nice. Pearl sheepishly glances around at the others who are all glaring at, are glowing at, glow, glowering? Glowering at her and hunches in shame. Stevie, you can't just push people out of the way to get what you want, Pearl. It's more friendly to think about other people first. Do you see? 
Pearl shakes her head timidly. Stevie, well, maybe this will make it clear. Song, put another before yourself. Put another before yourself before you go. See if anyone needs help. Okay. Alright, so this was one of those musical shows then. Oh, duct tape. Oh, that's right, because you can duct tape up the puppets. Um, Was I supposed to have my gun by now? Oh, shit. Where do I go? What Do I have a map? Okay. Antennas on the roof. Shut the hell up. Shut the hell up. I don't know which way I'm supposed to go. There's like so several different ways that I can go. I feel like I'm getting turned around already. <laughs> Watch from the other side. Oh, I jumped down, so now I can't get. Okay, all right. Um. No! Oh! oh! She's here to educate the children. I'm not the children, though. I don't need to be educated. Thank you. I don't know where I'm going. Press left button to swing the wrench. Okay. It's locked. Maybe I can break it open. Maybe I can... Oh. Break it open. No? All right. They ask you how you are, you just have to say that you're fine when you're not really fine. So what's the point of giving me a wrench if I can't swing it at shit? All right, that's fine. I know what I need to do. <laughs> I need to beat the shit out of some puppets. <laughs> I'm sorry. Hey, yo. I don't feel that in the morning. Oh, when enemies are knocked over, you can tape them up. Look at an enemy and press E. Okay, I'm not gonna waste my tape because I only have one. So I'm just gonna I'm just gonna beat him and then walk away. I guess public save station. Saved once. Health condition. Okay. All right. Cool. 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 Okay. So I got three tokens. I got 18 rounds of magazine. Open your map with M. Ugh, this place is big. Jeez. Public health station. I don't really need that right now. I'll be fine. God, I don't know what to do. I feel like I'm locked. No, you're not. Ow. Ow. Excuse me. I gotta get that down. I gotta, I gotta somehow figure out how to. Uh, more magazine, but I have no gun. I gotta somehow figure out how to avoid getting hurt. Oh, oh, we're back here. Okay, Liddy Titty. Excuse me. Why does she go down in three hits, but everybody else goes down in two? What? I'm gonna tape you up. You seem like a problem. Was that all I could do over here? Was that all? You wasted my time for that? Okay, how do I get back upstairs? Oh. I didn't realize that I hadn't unlocked that door the last time. Oh, I see where I'm at now. Okay. 
I got it. I'm picking up what you're putting down. And this is back outside, right? Okay. All right. I'm getting the feel of the layout now. Hey, Norman. Yeah, get fucked. Bitch. I'm going to tape you up. Norman's my biggest... <laughs> what the fuck? Have a smiling day. The Scribe. Tuesdays on MFN. My Friendly Neighborhood. The Puppet's Biggest Heist. Alright. Some story progression. <laughs> oh, there's my gun. There you are. Ricky! Oh, don't toddle off again. <clears throat> I've got some snackaroos waiting back in the lobby. Hey, what's going on here? Your puppet friends are attacking me. Oh, are they? How embarrassing. By the way, what's your name? What? Your name, your moniker, your handle, your nom de plume. It's Gordon. Gordon? What a beautiful name. I could say it all day. Gordon. 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 Is this a gun? Does it work? Oh my, that's where I left that. <laughs> hey, give it back. Give it back. Give it back. Fine. If you're going to go gallivanting all over the place, then at least watch out for Pearl. Pearl? You know, the enormous bird that crushes people. Don't get on her bad side, is all I <laughs> What was that? Hey, uh, okay. Ricky? Let's do this. Ricky? Oh, no! No! <laughs> Come at me. Come at me. We're okay. We're good. We're fine. <sighs> okay. All right. <laughs> Hank's diary. 4-16-69. I finally got it working. It's real butte. I think I'll call it the stenographer because it shoots letters out of an index. Shouldn't be dangerous at all, but it'll really give someone a clonk if they get hit in the head. Should be useful for security special for security special effects, fun, etc. Hank. Well, thanks, buddy, but I'm going to use it for other purposes. I have no tape, so... I don't think I have any purpose of coming back here. I think I should be fine if I don't tape these guys up. Locked. So if every door in this place is locked, where the feck am I supposed to go? Oh. Ooh. Ooh, blue circle key. Ooh. Ooh. Okay, okay, ooh, ooh, okay. All right, I know how to make progress now. So I got the blue circle key. I'm also low on ammo, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna switch back to the wrench. So I can go in here now because of the blue circle key. Whoa. Damn, this looks good. I'm hungry now. I'm suing this game because he made me hungry. Oh, no, we definitely need that. Not that the tape really matters because it only tapes them up for a little bit. It's taped shut. Okay, then cut it off. Stop being a little bitch. Ooh. Secret. Ooh! Where do I play it? Where do I play this at? Ooh! I'm so good! I'm so good! Hey, I killed that. You guys should have called me to be a voice actor for this game. Can I play it here? No? Okay. I thought I'd try, if anything. So we're back here now, and we have the blue circle key. So we unlock this door, go through here, and we make some progress. Let's fucking get it! Oh. 
This must be one of the old sets. Oh. I think I should. I think I should turn around. I don't think I should be here. Okay. <laughs> I don't think that I should be here. Yeah! Okay. <laughs> I was really testing something because I wanted to see if I attack one, will they all come after me? Whoa! 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 I'm gonna stay away from that. I'm not dealing with that. I don't exactly know how to commentate over on any of this because it's like. There's so much happening. There's so many different ways to go. <laughs> Stay away from me. Stay away from me. The latch won't release. Oh, come on. Don't be a bitch. Oh my god, she's roaming around! Why is that thing moving around? Can I save the game somewhere? I don't feel too safe. I don't... Oh. Okay. Uh, episode 23 script. Ricky, it's pizza time. Pizza time. Pizza time theme plays in the hard... And... <laughs> And the hand on the pizza time clock turns. Stevie enters. Stevie, what are you doing, Ricky? Ricky, oh, we were just about to go see what's in the pizza box. What's today's topping, Goblet? Goblet points at the clock. Goblet rumbling, Chovy. Ricky, anchovies. Boy, I love anchovies. Let's go. Oh, oh, anchovies. Right? 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 Did that do something? Was that a puzzle? I feel like that was a puzzle. Maybe I need another hand for the clock. Stay away from me. You don't want these problems. You don't want these problems. I told him he didn't want these problems. Shells. Give me my shotgun. I forgot, I get a shotgun in this game. Give me my goddamn shotgun. Ooh. Okay. Okay. It's a big puzzle game, really. Okay. So what kind of key did I grab? Orange square key. Fantastic. All right, this is the orange square door that we need to go through. Or at least one of them. Got my Bitcoin. Got one of the letter blocks. I have to collect, what is that? Three, six. I have to collect seven of these? Ooh! I'm gonna go ahead and save. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Okay. I I think this is a good place to end it. Maybe. Um. I don't know. I don't really feel like a lot happened in this video. I I mean, we get the gist of the game. We get the gist of what we're supposed to be doing. I, I believe the main goal of it is to get to the top of the um, get to the top of the building to take down the antenna and to avoid the puppets. I just feel like we jumped into the game really fast. Like we jumped into the concept of it all really quickly. I don't know. I it wasn't really all too easy to commentate over this. It felt very hard to be a YouTuber. I felt like I was just playing the game, but I'll continue to play it. I'll play a little bit more just to continue getting a feel of it. I've been recording for 45, 45 minutes and I'm going to have to do a lot of cuts because I wasn't really talking a whole bunch. Um, I don't know. Let me know what you guys think. I, 
I'm, I'm feeling mixed about it right now. Like, I was excited for it, but now that I'm playing it and actually trying to record it, it's kind of like, uh, I could do without making videos of this. But like I said, I'll give it another try and see how I feel once we progress a little further. There's just so many places to go. This feels like an open world linear game. You know what I mean? Anyways, I'm gonna get out of here. I love you guys. Stay safe out there. You never know when you're gonna encounter some sentient puppets. Uh, and a giant bird named Pearl. I don't know what's up with her. Um, take it easy. And big body out.